whenever you upload a video to YouTube that you have created or you've done a live stream, there may be times when you want to edit that video. Well, you can actually do that right from YouTube. The first thing you need to do is, of course, head over to your creator studio. Just come up to your logo or your icon there and go to creator studio. We are already in creator studio here. Then come down to the video manager, go to your videos and find the video or the live stream that you want to edit. So we'll just choose this one here. That's 37 minutes. Use our drop down. We'll just go to info and settings for now. Once we are at our video, we can edit this. A lot of times live streams might have some dead space in the front, say a minute, two minutes, sometimes five, 10 minutes in the front. And once that live stream is encoded and YouTube puts it up as a, uh, you know, as a video that you can play back at any time, you may want to cut out the first part of that video. Also, if you upload a normal video that you have created in your NLE, like Media Composer, for example, there may be something you need to cut out in there for whatever reason. Luckily, we can do that all from YouTube here. So once you're in the video that you want to edit, come up here to Enhancements. Choose that. I know it's a weird name, but this is actually where we would do this. Let's pause that video there. Come down to where it says Trim. Now we have a bunch of other options here uh, within our Creator Studio here in the Enhancements, but let's just focus on, on Trim here. Come down here and select Trim. Now we'll have options. So say this live stream here. Say I want to cut out this first two minutes. So you can see right now it's 37 minutes long. I don't want this first two minutes in there for whatever reason, no problem. Just use this bar, I'm gonna trim it up. Everything that we see in this sort of zebra pattern is now cut out. So we can trim this whole thing from the front. So we'll say up to around two minutes. Let's cut all that out. Very good, we're done there. Now what if somewhere in the middle here, there's something else I need to cut out? Say this here, not a problem, we'll choose split. Very good. And then we'll come down a bit further, say down to about here. I don't want people to see this part for whatever reason, and we'll split it again. Very good. So now I could say hit delete there, and that deletes that entire section. Basically, all you need to do is adjust your blue bars here. If you don't have a blue bar where you need it, say you want to cut out something in the middle, of course, just use split to add that blue bar, trim out either direction, uh, you know, what you want to trim out. And then once you're done, all you have to do is click done. So let's go ahead and fix this right here. Just select this. Say we want to get rid of that too. Very good. Now we'll just choose done. Okay. Now it's 24 minutes long, as you can see. And of course we have the option to revert to the original file. We can save this as a new video. And this is very useful if, for example, you want to cut out a certain clip and make that clip its own video. You don't need to download that live stream or re-edit your video in something like Media Composer, for example. You can actually create that new video clip right from uh, YouTube here, and you can save it as a new video. But what we will do is just choose Save and click Save. If there's someone currently watching your video, they will still see the full video until that uh, edit in progress, that new render is done. But you will have the same URL, assuming you chose save in place. So that's how easy it is to actually trim videos and even the live streams that you have already uploaded to YouTube. You don't need to re-upload anything. Just head into your creator studio, head into the video you want to edit, come up here to enhancements, come down to trim, select your blue bars, trim out whatever you want to trim out. Of course, split the video in different sections, trim out whatever you want to trim out again, delete entire sections, choose done, and then choose save as new video or save in place and you're all done trimming your video that's already on YouTube.